least this time I promise it won't break I'm hoping that things haven't changed Life took us far apart but it never took away my heart Have you been holding it safe? Cause it's been hard I'm coming home We'll stay up till morning and head out exploring Make up for moms that we've missed Cause the cold air is calling and my head's recalling The moment that I was convinced We'll stay up till morning and head out exploring so high Hey guys and welcome to another mom vlog this is going to be a day in the life or at least i'm going to try and make this a day in the life i'll try to remember to continue to vlog because a lot of times when i do days in life i completely forget to pick up the camera throughout the day but today we are unfortunately starting off um on a late start just because i forgot to set my camera the kids are eating breakfast right now um but I planned on waking up at 8.30. Like I said, I am starting this new schedule. And I woke up originally like around 7.15, 7.20. And then I went back to bed, which was my mistake. I should not have went back to bed because I knew that by going back to bed, it probably was going to make me more tired and it was going to be harder for me to wake up. But I went back to bed because both the kids were still sleeping. But I didn't realize I never set my alarm for around 8 o'clock. So I woke up when Ryan woke up. Ryan woke up. It was like... 8.45, 8.50 is when he woke up. So at the time I woke up and I realized the alarm went, never went off. So we are starting off on a late foot, which is completely fine. Yes, I made the schedule to try to make our day a little more organized and be able to get things done throughout the day. But like I said, I'm not gonna be super strict on it just because we're starting off like 30 minutes past schedule. It's not a big deal at all and I don't mind. So right now it is actually around 9.30. The kids are eating their breakfast. Once they're done with their breakfast, then they will go ahead and start school. They'll have an hour of school um, on the computer. It's called Digital Learning Days. So they will have that. And then also my first workout was supposed to be at um, around 10 o'clock. But instead of 10 o'clock, I'm going to do my first workout at noon because my gym is going live. They're doing like a live um, workout stream. And the girls I usually work out with around 930 when the gym was open. They texted me last night and said that they are gonna go live at noon. So for me to go live as well, so I can kind of feel like we are all together working out, be able to see each other and actually talk. So I'm gonna go live at noon, that should be fun. So I'm gonna try to get like a few clips of that to show you guys. It's and then, um, um, and yeah, that is the plan. And then also there's gonna be no outdoor playing today. It is 100% chance of rain all day. It has been raining 
all night. It's been raining all morning, so it's super wet outside and super muddy. It's actually still raining right now. It's not raining hard, it's just drizzling, but it's been raining all day. So no outside playtime today, but instead we'll do something fun inside. They still have like their free time and stuff. So no outdoor play today, but like I said, we'll figure something else out. But I'm gonna go ahead and I'll make sure Madison finishes her breakfast. Brian finishes his breakfast and then um, start the schoolwork. I'm actually gonna make myself a cup of coffee really quickly because I'm kind of tired. So make myself a cup of coffee and then get the day started. So, all right, so I'm gonna go ahead and get my coffee. So hopefully you guys enjoy coming along with us on our new schedule. So let mommy get some coffee and then we can get some schoolwork done, okay? I didn't do Ryan's hair, I did Madison's hair, but I didn't do Ryan's hair, but it's okay. We need a haircut, right? You want daddy to give you a haircut? I asked him yesterday, but he said no. He said no. Maybe he can do it Today? sometime. Well, he'll probably be late from work today, maybe later this week, finish your breakfast. <laughs> we are going to start some schoolwork now, so I'm gonna get Ryan in my computer. So let's go to the school website. So for the writing, it says, please click the link to view the writing mini lesson for today. After you have viewed the video, use the writing paper to start your piece. So, and it says, if you do not have a printer, please use any paper you have available. Mm -hmm. Remember, you are to write a realistic fiction story. You will make up your own characters and adventure that they go on and a problem they face. But make sure these things could actually happen in real life. So, we have to click this link and I guess you have to watch this video on YouTube. Oh, why is the volume working? Um, Here's more right back. Okay, there you go. So Ryan officially is has started her his schoolwork. Madison, I actually need to copy some paper. So for her, um, what the teacher did, it's this, it's called digital learning bingo. So she has to do stuff on here. We started this last week, um, but I also had an envelope full of stuff for her to like trace her name. She has to like trace her name and trace circles and stuff. But I need to go ahead and copy some of it um, so we can have extra this week. So this is an example I'm gonna have her do today, which is tracing her name. And then there are tracing lines and stuff. So I can get this out. So stuff like this, I need to go ahead and go upstairs and copy this so we can have extra to do during the week. But this is what she's gonna do. I'm gonna do a few pages of that with her and then pick something off of this bingo, which I'll probably do the, let your child help you cook a simple meal. So it says your child can help pour, measure, and stir. They can also use finger isolation to press buttons on a timer. Remember to talk about kitchen safety. So I'll probably do that as well with her. So that'll be her work. And then Ryan has quite a few units to do. They're starting a whole new unit this week. So we'll see how that goes because last week, everything they did was stuff that the teacher already did with them in the class that they already learned. This week is a whole new unit a bunch of new things that they have not worked on before so it's going to be new to them so hopefully i can help them as much as possible the teacher is very sweet she said if we have any questions or the kids are having trouble with it we can email her and she will help us out so right now he has to watch a video really quickly and then he has to write a passage so um i'm gonna let him finish that work with madison and then uh, in an hour what time is it it's 10 o'clock, so in like two hours is when I'll start doing my first workout. Good job, look. 
Good job. Yeah. Yay! Is your name Madison? Yeah? Is your name Madison? Okay, look. Go ahead. No. Hold on. Let's do the M. That's a good job. You're doing good now. The A. D. I. Maddie, Maddie, you gotta look. Maddie, look. You gotta look. Hey, look. How's your story coming? Good. Good? Ryan had to write a story and draw a picture. He's doing a good job. Do you like it? She don't finish watching it. You love it. All right, guys, so it is currently 1235. So I just finished my workout um, and I it was a core workout. So I did that um, and now I'm about to make the kids some lunch. So like I said, we are a little off schedule. So on the schedule, I said I was going to have the kids eat lunch at 12, but we're like 40 minutes past that but it's okay i'm about to make them lunch i think i'm gonna throw in um i think i have a cauliflower yeah. pizza so i'll probably put that in the oven for me and madison and then ryan what do you want for lunch pizza what's well, a cauliflower pizza do you want to try it it's the crust is made of cauliflower flour. yeah but cauliflower is kind of like broccoli remember i'll have it i'll mm -hmm. have the cauliflower pizza all right so i guess we're all having cauliflower cheese pizza for lunch and then after that, we are going to do, you say you want to do a science experiment? Yeah. Okay, so I'll our- show, I'll show you guys. Um, our free activity is going to be a science experiment. I actually got him this for his birthday. And I got it from Walmart a while back. It was on clearance. So it's called Universe Glowing Crystal. So this is what we are going to do for our um, little activity. This is what he chose. So. Once we're done with lunch, we will go ahead and do that. So I'm pretty sure this vlog is already pretty long because I talk a lot. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the pizza in the oven because like I said, it's already almost one o'clock and we're supposed to eat lunch at 12, which is fine. But I'm gonna let him um, watch TV. What are you watching? What is it? It's a document. It's like a little document about animals. So he's gonna watch that. I'm gonna find songs and stuff. Cool. So he's gonna do that. Madison's on the couch as well, doing that as well. I do wanna film on another video. I'll probably going to film the kids activity, um, like education activities to do at home. So I'll film that and then if I have time, then I will film a spring clean with me. Um, I haven't decorated for spring and spring has already started. So if I can get into the attic and pull down all the spring stuff, then maybe I'll do that as well. But. This is the pizza I'm gonna make. It's just a cheese cauliflower pizza from Whole Foods. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the oven on. What do we put this on? 425. So I'm gonna make the pizza and then I will vlog a little more once I do that little crystal thing with Ryan. But Maddie did her work. Um, did you do your work? Are you ready for pizza? Are you so excited? You want to get mouth blue. Oh, you were eating this, weren't you? She kept, she was on chewing on Ryan's notebook, and I've taken it away from him a million times. But you ready for some cauliflower pizza? I'm ready to. All right.
One, two, three, four, five. And then you're gonna do the same thing and see how wide he is, the length. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, let's see his length. No, I have to do it in color order or else it won't work. Okay. So how long is One, he? two, three, four, five, six. Okay, let me write Rex again. Rex. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. Good job. All right, so what dinosaur are you going to do next now? This raptor. Okay. I'm going to write rap for raptor. Rap. Okay. One more should do it. Can you, can you get me a gray Lego? All right, guys, so it is a little bit later, and I was just about to do that little science experiment craft with Ryan, which is this universe glowing crystal. I don't know what I was thinking when I got this. This is going to take like five days to complete. I didn't know it was going to take that long. I thought you can just do it in one day. So basically the first step I have to boil water and I have to mix some of the it aluminum is. paper, I mean paper, aluminum powder, and I have to let that sit overnight. And then after that I have to mix, um, and then the next day I have to mix the plaster mix and the plaster mix has to dry for three days or longer. And then after what? the three days is pa after the three days Two. pass, then Two. I have to um, let the rock itself sit out for at least one day to dry. So that's a total of five days that I have to do this. So it doesn't look very fun, but Ryan's really excited about it. So I'm gonna go ahead and boil water. It says I have to boil water and like I said, mix it with this and then it has to sit in the cup overnight yeah, and then it's gonna cup. form i guess crystals and then we have to pick out the crystals and let that dry for i don't and, know how long and i guess you can paint it because it comes with some paint yeah you have to let it dry so dry. i'm gonna go ahead and boil and some comes, water and then mix this, like, some of this um sulfate powder and then i guess let it sit overnight i don't know where i'm gonna put it because madison gets into everything so i'm going to find a spot to um put it in but it did also come with a really cool poster it came with a really big glowing poster so i know at the end it'll be worth it and he's really gonna love it i think it is pretty cool but again i just did not think it was gonna take that long it says fun fresh educational kits where science meets style nerdy is cool learning is fun and individuality is key you can be fashionable and super cool scientists all at the same time so I'm gonna go ahead and boil some water and yeah, mix that in a cup. Show them the, the, the. You're gonna show them the poster? That's the poster it came with? Yeah. It's a cool poster. All right, I'm gonna go Rock ahead your and. glow, everybody. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and boil some water. end up as an epic fail because it didn't come with one of the things that was supposed to so it says i'm supposed to add a pinch of the fluorescent dye to the mixture that has to sit overnight which is going to create the crystals and there's no fluorescent dye in this box so that sucks because it says um when you shine the uv flashlight on your crystals you can see how they glow in the dark that Fluorescent dye is what makes it glow, Here's, but it didn't include light. it. So that's the light, but there's no fluorescent dye. So it really sucks because I don't know if this is going to work at all since that fluorescent dye wasn't in here, but we're still gonna try. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, let the mixture, which is in this bowl right here, I'm gonna let that sit overnight. And then tomorrow we will pull out the crystals and let that um, dry off. And then we will do the mold, the plaster mold, which is the next step. 
and see how it turns out. So I'll let you guys know. I'll keep you guys updated. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, definitely follow me over there because that's where I will keep you guys updated on how this turns out. So yeah, that's a quick update. But now it is four o'clock. So I'm going to go ahead and clean all of this up and then have Ryan do Khan Academy. He still hasn't done Khan Academy yet today. So I'm going to have him do that for a little bit. And then for the rest of the day, it'll kind of be, I guess, like our free time. We've done schoolwork. We've done experiments. I also filmed um, three fun educational activities for kids at home. I'll probably insert a few clips in this vlog, but that should be up before this vlog. If it is, I will link it down below. If not, definitely look out for that. So I'll probably insert a few clips of that. So we've done a lot of schoolwork and fun activities. So the only thing he has to do now is um, his Khan Academy for 25 to 30 minutes. And then the rest of the day will kind of be just hanging out. So cooking dinner and then they'll have their free time of whether watching TV, even though Madison has been watching TV or going on the tablet. So I'm gonna go ahead and clean all this up and hopefully it works out. We'll see how it goes. It's almost night night time. We should be brushing our teeth right now, but there you go. That's your last snack for the night and then we gotta go to bed, okay? Brian's over there on his tablet, also eating Cheetos before bedtime. Madison hasn't really felt well. I think she has a ear infection because she keeps on grabbing her ear and then she has her GI issues, but they're gonna finish up their snacks. Ryan's gonna be on his tablet for a little bit. What are you watching? I'm trying to find school. Now I'm gonna watch the recess queen. Subscribe for more story time. He loves books and stuff, so he's watching story time on the tablet where they read books to him. Mm -hmm. And then Madison is watching Peppa. So once she's done, we're gonna brush your teeth and go night night. Are you sure How is that? Is that yummy? How delicious is that? How good is that? Do you feel better? Oh, you see mommy in the background in the mirror. How is it? Is it delicious? <laughs> is it delicious? I love when you smile. All right, you guys, so excuse my appearance, but it is actually a few days later and I was just now finishing up editing this vlog and there was no outro. It's typical me that I completely forget to film outros, especially when I vlog. So I just wanna jump on here really quickly to film a proper outro to this day in the life. So I hope you guys enjoyed this day in the life of our new routine. Like I said, I made this new schedule for me and the kids just because I feel like we've been sleeping in a lot and we haven't been really getting a lot of things done throughout the day that we should be getting done. So this was day one. Now we were a little behind just because my alarm clock didn't go off, but it was still a productive day. So I hope you guys enjoyed this day in the life vlog if you did please remember to give my vlog this video a thumbs up also subscribe and turn on your notification but if you have not already i would love to have you be a part of my youtube family as always thanks so much for watching i love you guys stay safe and i will see you guys in my next video bye